Hey guys, what is up? This is Josh here, and I'm bringing you a review of the DC Collectibles New 52 Suicide Squad Captain Boomerang. Now, I don't know too much about this character, but all I know is he has a bunch of boomerangs, he throws them and whatnot, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Sorry, that's all I know. Um, yeah. I remember this guy in the Just League cartoon and Just League Unlimited. But he's part of Suicide He's part of the Suicide Squad, so he must be like some pro assassin or mercenary, so yeah, let's take a look at this guy's detail. You can see he's sporting the toque. You know, I'm from Canada. I sport the toque, so yeah, go toques. It's blue, it's nice. Well, it's not focusing. There we go. You can see the lines in it. And it looks knitted. Or it looks like wool or some kind of fabric. It's got like the little boomerang symbol on his toque. You can see his face. He's smirking. He's got blue eyes. He's got like little pink bags underneath his eyes. He looks pretty tired. He's got orange hair. And dang! This dude's got some dirty ears. Dang, dude, you gotta clean that. Uh, you can see a scarf. It is a separate piece. It's made of a nice rubber material. Uh, it may look kind of white on camera, but it's actually like a baby blue kind of washed out white, if that makes sense. Same with the trim on his jacket. It's like a white, but it's like washed out with like baby blue kind of. So, yeah. And he has a nice jacket. Very nice. Looks very leathery. Or, yeah, or whatever these kind of jackets are made of. Whatever material. Looks very nice. Or coat, I should say. You can see little buttonholes, the little pocket. Very nice. You can see the little buttons here. And that's why I like DC collectibles. They put nice detail into their figures, and their clothing looks pretty real. You can see he's got like a little chest belt of boomerangs if I can just kind of move the scarf all the way it's a, like a black belt or satchel or whatever you call it and his boomerangs are silver pretty cool he's got a blue shirt underneath his jacket you can see the little zipper or white and yeah um he's got black gloves black leathery gloves it's nice shiny gloss black he's got one accessory he comes with and that is his silver boomerang uh it looks nice it looks pretty detailed the one thing i don't like about it though is it looks nice and i like how it's edged but then when you turn it on the other side it's like completely flat so it's like it doesn't look too great see just that looks pretty pretty weird but yeah uh, he's got a nice black black belt, silver belt buckle there. He's got some kind of bluish black pants, the white stripe going down the side. He's got some shiny black boots with like silver silvery guards on him, on it or whatever, like a shin guard so he could kick you. Uh, He's got some nice boot soles. They're like a, it's like a dark blue. Very nice. And his boots are nicely sculpted. He's got a peg hole on his foot. It's very nice. Very nice. Let's take a look. So yeah, that's the detail. Articulation. He's got a ball jointed head. It could go up, down, side to side, and it could kind of rock back and forth. Uh, so yeah. He's got a ball socket shoulder, very nice. He's got no bicep swivel. He's got a hinge at the elbow though, and he's got an elbow swivel. So I guess that kind of makes up for the bicep swivel. And he's got a rotation at the glove. Um, for midsection, he's got nothing, but he does have a waist swivel. He's got a ball jointed hip, very nice. Uh, he's got a hinge knee, boot swivel, and he's got a hinged ankle which I'm not a fan of, uh, just because, and 
that's that's pretty much the articulation and detail on this dude. A uh, couple gripes. Again, he could only hold his boomerang in his right hand, just like Deadshot can only hold his gun in his left hand. I really hate that. Um, but I do like how his left hand is kind of open. This way, like you can get really nice throwing poses. So that's cool, I guess. But still. Um, and then again. I really hate ankle articulation just because they loosen up. The ankles loosen up over time and figure it becomes floppy and it's kind of hard to stand them and they fall over and you catch my drift. So, But yeah, uh, let's get a size comparison. So let's bring in his team member from Suicide Squad and that's Deadshot. Uh, they look nice together. Very, very cool. You can see Captain Boomerang is taller because he's pretty lanky. It's pretty lanky. He's got long legs and whatnot. And he's pretty skinny too. Gotta eat, bro. Um, but yeah, that has been my review of the DC Collectibles New 52 Suicide Squad Captain Boomerang. Uh, he's a cool figure. If I had to rate him, I'd give him, meh, give him a 7.5, just because. He's pretty, uh, when you when you think about it, he's pretty plain looking. Not much to him. Uh, I don't know much about the character. And it's just my personal preference on this guy or whatever. So yeah, guys, these figures are awesome. This is a great way to kick off 2014 for DC Collectibles. I'm really liking these guys. Uh, stay tuned for my Harley Quinn review. Uh, she'll hopefully be up right after this guy. Um... And if you haven't already, please check out my Deadshot review. And, okay guys, stay tuned for more as always. Catch you later. Take care.